keep a sharp watch here. to burn some cargo. There's resolve in you. We have that in common. I saw innocence trapped in the flames. I did what I could. The flames were thick. No one can be spared of Hades. My thanks anyways. My name's Cassandra. 
I'd thank you too, if I knew who you were. Razidas of Sparta. You're a newcomer to Corinth. You're a spy too? An old Spartan tactic? I have my ways. I get the sense that's a Corinthian hobby. Anthusa has her Etera watching from every post. Ah, Anthusa. We disagree, but have a common enemy. The monger? We agree he should be killed, but we differ on how. So, Sparta also has a monger problem. What do you know about him? His weapon has a far reach. Corinth is allied with Sparta. It's our duty to protect them. Then working alongside Anthusa is your best bet. If she had her way, the monger would be flayed in the streets. Sparta wants him dealt with quietly. What do you want to do with him? Right now, the monger rules Corinth. I want to replace him with minimal bloodshed. He'll only be dethroned if he's killed. It's simple. Yes. Diplomacy isn't something he understands. From what I hear, I'm not surprised. We arrested his top men, armed the citizens, tried to stir the police against him. It never came to be. The only thing left to try... is a quick slice of the blade! That would do it. We'd lure him into Corinthia's sacred cave, and it'd be over! By the time I leave, Corinthia, the monger will be dead. Do that, and Sparta will be in your debt. I was Spartan, once. Once? Until I was thrown off Mount Aietos as a child, and left for dead. You're the daughter of General Nikolaos? All of Sparta knows your name! And here you are, alive! Impossible! I survived. I raised myself alone, while life continued in Sparta. Never mind being a Spartan. Those of good character will forgive and should be forgiven. I'm on the hunt for my mother, Mirini. And the only way is through Anthusa. Yes, Mirini. You don't know anything about Mirini, do you? I know that no one should have to endure such tragedy alone. And I heard she left Sparta that night. No one has forgotten Marini. From what I know, she wanted them to forget. There's no going back now. The displaced can always find their way home. The gods have just decided you must fight for it. They couldn't make it any easier. Chin up, Spartan. Easy doesn't exist. Goodbye, Brasidas. We'll meet again. I'm in the fight with you. Show courage. Your plan seemed to work. The monger's thugs ambushed me. I heard. I also heard you had no problems dealing with them. It wasn't my first fight in Corinth. Or your last. We're going to take the monger to task at the theater. I've arranged a Corinthian drama no one will forget. Brasidas is worried about the anarchy that could follow the monger's death. He wants him dead. But wants it done quietly. That man is a long way from Sparta. This is Corinthia, so we'll do it the Corinthian way. I agree with Brasidas. I say we take him to the sacred cave. This isn't what we planned. The monger needs to be erased from existence. We'll fight him in a private place, and he'll die. A simple transaction, remember? If you insist, we'll meet you at the sacred cave.
So it is you, a demigod in the soot and shit streets of Corinth, killing my men, helping those fucking parasites? That's me. Ah, arrogant! Just like your mother! You'll never rule these streets, you pig! Oh, you bet your pretty face I will! Get your filthy hands! And when I do... I'll rip your fucking head right off, and send it to the cult as proof! What? You knew? Oh, I fucking knew her all right. She was big fucking trouble. But I'll pay her back. When I'm done with you, I'm gonna find your mother and bring her your fucking head! Demos will wish she was watching this. Not if I bring her yours first. Get the fuck out of my city! It's not yours anymore. Get the fuck off my streets! I could have been there to watch Demos break your neck. Don't make me laugh. Wait, no! The people of Corinth must see him die. Anthusa. Take him out of here and bring him to the theater. Show everyone his cowardice. No. You wanted him dead. Here he is. It's a shame the people don't get to see him bleed. His cries should have rung out across the city. He's dead. I've delivered. Your turn. Huh. 
Yes. You're right. He's dead. Take his body to the square. Let the people get a last good look at him. As for you, Cassandra, I owe you information. We'll talk about your mother, just not here. I can't give you enough thanks for what you've done. <laughs> and for once, I can also thank Alcibiades. He sent you here, after all. There's more to him than meets the eye. He knew you could save Corin from that beast. Everybody benefits, everybody wins. You've proven to be a very valuable business partner. Speaking of business, you owe me, Anthusa. Yes, Mirini. She came and left Corinthia in a flurry, but made an impression on me. Like a great storm. I remember that part of her well. A strong woman with great intensity. She wanted to find her place here in Corinth, but never found what she was looking for. You speak of her kindly. You were her friend. Perhaps on the surface, but she had a great pain in the middle of her that no one could get to. After Corinth, where did she go? That? I don't know. She must have given you some hint. I don't think even she knew where she was headed. All I know is she won a ship thanks to a lucky dice throw. Tihi owed her that much, at least. I remember the ship's name well. Siren Song. Siren Song? It was famous for weathering all that Poseidon threw in its path. Thank you, Anthusa. May the gods look well upon you, Cassandra. Visit me any time. I'll catch you up on Corinth's affairs. It seems I have an interesting future ahead of me. So do I. I am so. If I can find someone who knows the ship, I'll be one step closer to finding her. I should have enough information now. I should head back to Athens to see Aspasia. What would you like?
I think. There's something you need. 